Hi folks, this is Tony for a minute to midnight.com with a bit of an update. Please make sure you subscribe to us at our website, a minute to midnight.com. And also remember, we are run 100% by donations, and it's greatly appreciated when people do help us. Now, I'm aware that as things unfold, there is liable to be more censorship. So I'm going to be taking precautions here and not publish this whole video on YouTube. So please, if you're seeing this on YouTube, go to our website, a minute to midnight.com or our Rumble channel or our BitChute channel or our Apple podcast channel to listen to this. Already in New Zealand, I'm not able to access the Jerusalem Post. I don't know whether... Um, that's just New Zealand or whether there's something global going down with that but I have not been able to today to get the, onto the Jerusalem Post to look at news articles there so I am suspecting that we will see an increase in censorship and controlling of the narrative around war so what I want to say in this video I want to keep it reasonably brief but I'm feeling very very unsettled um, about what's going on and I think all of us are um, rather shocked and horrified at what's gone on in Israel in the last uh, three days basically coming out of the blue I think many of us have been anticipating something big was coming and there'd been a little bit of a lull before the next phase of what was going to happen you know, we've had the war in the Ukraine and I think people are sick of hearing about that, sick of the whole narrative and pumping money in and Zelensky coming with his cap in his hand begging for money all the time. And that was starting to fade a little bit. Um, the, you know, there are other things that take people's attention. 